Introducing the NutriPlanet News with Jasmine and Bradley. Hey there, Nutronauts. Welcome back to NutriPlanet News. Today, we're talking about something super special that takes over every fall. Pumpkins. Did you know that pumpkins are not just fun to decorate, but they're also really good for you? Let's dive in and find out more. First of all, can you guess how many different kinds of pumpkins there are? Believe it or not, there are over 45 types. Some are small and sweet, perfect for making yummy treats like pies, while others are humongous and can weigh more than 1,000 pounds. That's as heavy as a small car. And pumpkins come in all sorts of colors, not just orange. They can be white like a ghost, green with speckles, deep red, and many other cool shades. Some even have bumps that make them look like they have warts. People have been growing and eating pumpkins for a really long time, thousands of years in fact. The oldest pumpkin seeds were found in Mexico and are over 7,500 years old. That's even older than the ancient Egyptian pyramids. Pumpkins play a big part in fall celebrations around the world, from the jack-o'-lanterns we carve for Halloween to the pies we eat at Thanksgiving. But pumpkins aren't just fun and tasty. They're also packed with good stuff that helps keep your body healthy. The bright orange color of pumpkin flesh comes from something called beta-carotene, which your body turns into vitamin A. Vitamin A is like a superhero for your body. It helps you see better in the dark, keeps your skin healthy, and even helps your body grow and develop. It's like a bodyguard that protects you from the inside out. Pumpkins also have a lot of vitamin C, which is like a shield that keeps you from getting sick. When you feel a cold coming on, vitamin C jumps in to help your body fight it off. But that's not all. Vitamin C also helps your body heal cuts and wounds, and it keeps your skin, teeth, and bones strong and healthy. It's like a construction worker that's always busy fixing and building parts of your body. Another great thing about pumpkins is that they have a lot of fiber, which keeps your tummy happy and healthy. Fiber helps you feel full after meals, so you don't want to eat unhealthy snacks as much. And let's not forget about potassium, a mineral that keeps your heart beating steadily and your muscles working the way they should. So, when you eat pumpkin, you're giving your body a bunch of important nutrients to keep it strong and healthy. Now, when you're picking out the perfect pumpkin, there are a few things to look for. First, pick one that feels heavy for its size. That means it's full of water and fresh. Make sure the surface is firm and smooth, without any soft spots or bruises. Soft spots can mean the pumpkin is starting to go bad. If you want to cook with your pumpkin, choose a smaller, sweeter kind, like sugar pie or Cinderella pumpkins. These types are great for baking and cooking because they taste rich and sweet, and they have a smooth texture. Sugar pie pumpkins are often used to make pumpkin pies, while Cinderella pumpkins, which are bright orange and kind of flat, are perfect for making soups and other dishes. There are so many yummy ways to enjoy pumpkins. Don't throw away the seeds inside. You can roast them with a little salt for a crunchy, healthy snack. They've got protein, good fats, and fiber. Bake the flesh. The orange part of the pumpkin is great for making pies, muffins, and bread. Just scoop it out, bake it until it's soft, and then blend it into a smooth puree. You can use this puree in all sorts of recipes to add a sweet, earthy flavor and lots of nutrients. The possibilities are endless. And now, let's test your pumpkin knowledge with a fun quiz. Get ready to answer some interesting questions about everyone's favorite fall fruit. First question, which city is known as the pumpkin capital of the world? Is it A, Morton, Illinois, B, Salem, Massachusetts, C, Orlando, Florida, or D, Pueblo, Colorado? The answer is A, Morton, Illinois. This town is called the pumpkin capital of the world because of the Libby's plant located there. Libby's makes most of the canned pumpkin used around the world, which has made the town famous and helped its economy. Every year, Morton has a big pumpkin festival that brings in thousands of people. Next question. What fun activity uses giant pumpkins as boats? Is it A, pumpkin surfing? B, pumpkin regattas? C, 
pumpkin rolling, or D, pumpkin diving? The right answer is B, pumpkin regattas. In these fun events, people hollow out giant pumpkins and use them as boats in races. These silly and festive races happen every year in different parts of the United States and Canada. It's a unique way to celebrate the pumpkin harvest and brings communities together for some friendly competition. Now for a question about books. Where did the word pumpkin first show up in a story? Was it in A, The Brothers Grimm Fairy Tales? B, Cinderella? C, Sleepy Hollow? Or D, Harry Potter? The answer is B, Cinderella. The word pumpkin was first used in the fairy tale Cinderella. A French explorer initially called these fruits gros melons, which were later translated to English as pompions, before becoming the word pumpkin. The story of Cinderella's magical pumpkin coach has made pumpkins a lasting symbol in popular culture. Here's a history question. What were the first jack-o'-lanterns made from? A. Apples. B. Pumpkins. C. Turnips. Or D. Watermelons. The answer is C. Turnips. Carving jack-o'-lanterns started in Ireland, where people first used turnips and potatoes to make these lanterns. When Irish immigrants came to America, they discovered that pumpkins were better for carving, so they started using pumpkins for jack-o'-lanterns instead. This tradition has continued and changed into the Halloween custom we know today. Last question. What is the record weight for the heaviest pumpkin ever grown as of 2023? Is it A, 2,149 pounds? B, 2,500 pounds? C, 2,323 pounds? Or D, 2,145 pounds? The correct answer is A, 2,149 pounds. In 2023, Travis Ginger from the USA set the record for the heaviest pumpkin, which weighed an incredible 2,149 pounds. Can you imagine how many pies you could make with that? This amazing achievement shows just how dedicated and skilled pumpkin growers can be. Wasn't that quiz fun? In conclusion, pumpkins are more than just a fun fall decoration. They're packed with good nutrients that help keep your body healthy and strong. So, this fall, whether you're carving a jack-o'-lantern, baking a pie, or trying a new pumpkin recipe, you're also giving your body a tasty treat that's good for you. Happy pumpkin season, everyone.